Hey everyone, how's it going? It's me, it's Korzak. In this video, I am showing you a raw gold farm. You can do this between level 60 and 70. If you have people in your party, you can get it done faster. So my starting gold is 86 gold. So we are gonna run through F1. My solo time for this is about three minutes and we have another person in the party right now. So he's gonna run on ahead of me and I'm gonna clear out the first few groups which will make this run faster since the mobs are a higher level than me. And whenever I take a monster out, we get a very high sense and ability points. And since they're his level, we're still going to get very high points. So we're just going to run through here, take out all the monsters. I really recommend that you do your last job change so that you can unlock your ultimate ability. This will make it so you can use your ultimate ability against the boss. Ideally, you'll be able to use it on every other run, which will help you out a little bit. Okay, so we're already here at the boss right now in under one minute. I need to raise my awakening engage just a little, so we're gonna do it right now. That should take out most of the extra monsters and deal decent damage to the boss. Depending on your class, you may do more or less damage. So now we're just gonna focus on taking this guy out and that's it really. I recommend, I don't have it on my hot bar right now, but I recommend you keep matchsticks on your bar so that when he freezes you, you can just get rid of the effect by using the item. Me and this other guy are quite geared, so we do that maybe a little quicker than other people, but see, that took us about two minutes. So now we're just gonna have to wait about 15, 20 seconds. You do split the gold that drops right here. It's usually 40 silver per coin if you're by yourself. But doing this with about two people, you can do it with up to four, but two people is also okay. Gata coins aren't as useful as they used to be. So you can use them on every single run here to get a fourth drop. So you get that raw gold. It gave me about one gold, which may not seem like a lot. So then we open up this pouch here that gives me two gold. Now if we quit and go to the guy right here, these are the items I got. So that's four gold right there, that's seven gold, and that's 11 gold. Sometimes you'll get weapons to drop, you can sell them for 10 to 11. So that took me about two and a half minutes in total. So here's the calculation of how much raw gold you'll get. So the raw gold you get with a teammate is 468 gold per hour. And the raw gold that you get by doing it solo is 365.5 gold per hour. So doing it with a teammate is going to be much faster than doing it by yourself. You can play around with three or four people and kind of see what works best for you. Because depending on your level, it may kind of mess you up. Because you want to be consistently getting triple S's. Alright, that's it for this video. I hope it helped. We'll have more guides in the future. So I'd like to thank you for watching. I hope you have a good day and we'll see you soon. Bye.